For your health, fighting the flu, some big changes this year for those who do not like shots. Ricky Mitchell is here now, and this year, Ricky, the flu mist is not available. That's right, Carol. Doctors still, of course, recommend getting the vaccine as soon as possible, but this year, only the flu shot will be effective in fighting it. With the changing season comes a change in the flu vaccine. Dr. Lynn Ranta is the director of physician affairs at Children's Hospital of Wisconsin. She says the flu mist that many received as a vaccine in the past will not be available this year. We know that particular we're probably going to see some strains that are very similar to the last two years. There's always a predominant influenza A strain and influenza B strain. And they were able to do that predictive modeling to show that the particularly the one strain wasn't going to be really well. The flu mist vaccine wasn't going to really protect you well. She says it's hard to say when the flu will strike, but doctors recommend getting the shot as soon as possible. We've been shown that even getting it as early as August, it still gives you good protection throughout the entire flu season. While she recommends everyone over six months old gets the shot, she also said pregnant women and people with chronic illnesses are especially vulnerable. Ah, and for children dreading the shot this year. She says doctors at Children's Hospital clinics work to make it as smooth as possible. We use a lot of sort of distraction techniques and ways to help manage pain um, so that you can kind of talk the kids through it because we know they would prefer not to have a shot. And we have more information about this year's flu vaccine at TMJ4.com. Charles. All right, Ricky, thanks. <laughs>